John's gonna be onto me. You know? Ooh, <laughs> a star. It's a B from me. Ooh. What's holding the, the D? Ooh. Oh, no D. Yo, relax. yo. Hey, relax. Essie's <laughs> done. already been done. Beatty's already been done. Be yourself. Well, people need to just take note of the goats. Try to find their own way of reaching those levels. B for bias. Yeah. All right. Cool. Say. That was a good one. <laughs> that was a good one. That was a good one. What's going on, people, and welcome back to Roots TV. And yeah, back in Wembley, man. Come on, I can't leave this place alone, man. And I'm joined by V10 from Your Fresh. How you doing, my bro? I'm good, my guy, man. You good? Let's, let's, let's greet each other this time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm good, man. It's good to be here. Roots TV, make sure you like and subscribe. Come on. Um, but yeah, no, it's a pleasure, man. Yeah, you ready to cause some controversy? That's my middle name, man. Okay. Yeah, V Controversy 10. <laughs> All right, I like it. We're Get getting me. the full thing, okay. Well, if you ain't seen by the title bar now, we're doing a tier list. Cheers, Beaties. Um, we're going to be ranking some Sunday League teams from our opinions. Yeah? Oh, shit, okay. Cool. Usually, Beaties do it, but they're in the scene. It's nice to have someone that's outside looking in. Say no more. And then just giving our views on it. And it's done by the three C's, yeah? Okay. So, content. Yeah. Character. Okay. And consistency. Jeez. Those are the main three C's that I look for. I like it. Yeah? Three C's, let's yeah, get it. Yeah, three C's, man. Um, so, where should we start? Wherever you want, man. You've got the list. Okay. Right, I've um, got the list. So, we're going to start off with Beatty's. Beatty's, okay, cool. So. So, how does this work, by the way? Like, are we just rating we, them out of 10 or something like that? We'll do like a, a grading system. Okay, cool. Yeah, like, okay. you know, when you're back at school, A star. Oh, I didn't get too many A stars, to be fair. Okay, cool, cool, um, cool, cool, cool. You know, A star overall. Say yeah? no more. Say no so, more. So, A star, of course, is the best. And then we'll have F for just pure failure. Jeez. Put down the camera. Yeah, That's if, you, it. if you get an F, just wrap it up. That's it, you're done. Yeah. But we won't give no Fs, yeah. I don't think. The person's <laughs> on the list. <laughs> yeah, <they're laughs> so let's start with BTs. Um, content wise, it's definitely an A, man. Yeah, top tier. Did you watch the, um, the Liner Cup final? They yeah. It's a movie, man. Like, movie. Shout out to them, man. Yeah, and yeah. I don't know what's better. I don't know if it was that one's better or remember when they were in the, in the Nationals? The Nationals was top tier as well. Oh, yeah, epic. I feel like uh, the Nationals... That, that, that half-time team talk from Bill. Yeah, no, it was... It, that got I, me. Oh, they're, they're both top tier, man. I don't even want to differentiate between yeah, the yeah, two, yeah. man. Yeah, but again, that's stuff. the levels we're talking, you know, yeah, yeah, in terms yeah. of commentary, in terms of the whole overall productions, because they've got the different angles. Yeah, no, levels, man. Levels, yeah, different yeah, levels, yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. They, like, they capture so many angles, innit? So like, they've got uh, Joel Bayer commentary. Top tier, we know that already. Mm. The camera qualities that they're using mm. is top tier as well. Mm -hmm. The angles they're getting. And then also the off of the pitch content that they're getting alongside it as well. Yeah. Like the, the interviewing people for the games and changing rooms and sideline. Yeah. They're getting it all. Yeah. And then also uh, the banter's top tier mm. from them as well. So I, I can't fault them, to be fair. Okay, so A star in that category, we move on to characters. So characters, characters yeah, yeah. like you said, you got Joel Bear, who's you got Imed, Imed, yeah, <laughs> most hated. Yeah, um, I think the guy that I'm talking about, I don't know if he's a, ca I think he's the cameraman for them as well. Is it Mark? Let Mark play. Hashtag Let Mark play. Or are you talking about Biz? Who no, does not the podcast? Blizz, not Blizz. I know Blizz. I know. Okay. Ah uh, oh, man, I don't. It must be Mark. He's got, he's got the dreads, man. And yeah, it's Mark. Oh, it's Mark, yeah? yeah? yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 Mark, yeah. Mark, levels, yeah, 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 yeah. levels stuff. I got worried from at one stage where they lost a lot of their old characters. Um, Theo, Theo yeah, Teniola, yeah, 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 all of them yeah, ones, yeah, yeah, but yeah. I think where, I don't know, is there any East London thing that you just got that bravado about them, that, that sort of... Well, Emma has been there from the jump. Yeah. Uh, Joel Bayer, I think, not Bayer, uh, Joel Mensah has been there yeah. from, um, from as far as I can remember, He's personally. been there for time, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, in terms of the new characters they're bringing out, mm. it's, it's Mark and who else would you say is like a standout from the new? Uh, oh, Gio, left Gio. back. Gio. Cisco G. Yeah, he's a yeah, character yeah, still. Yeah, he's, yeah a he's a character. He's a character still. Yeah. Um, Even, um, how can you forget, Black Sonic. Oh, no. yeah, 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 yeah. Black Josh, Sonic. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Josh Asude, he's a character himself. Yeah, no, so they got right. characters they and got again, they showcase them in, in their in their best lights. <laughs> but it's funny you touch on like the whole East London thing. I feel, I feel like there is a bit of swagger about East London yeah, on camera store. Like, for sure. Even when you go back to like the grime days, like there yeah. was, we had like So Solid, we're a bit more gritty and stuff and that. Yeah. But then like the East characters like Wiley and they was a bit more animated, like Dizzy, <laughs> um, Kano. 
there, there's a bit more of like a unity, I guess, in yeah. East when it comes to creating content yeah. um, on camera and, and work ethic and stuff like that. There you so go. yeah, you got, you got to give it to them still. And it's reflected in the content as well, so mm. I've got to give that A star as well. Amen. And, and before you even say it, consistency is an A star as well. A star because so every single week. They're dropping and without on fail. their socials, they're constant, constant. And also, I like the fact that they're innovative as well. I think- That's when, what I was about to say, bro. Were they one of the first ones to come up with Mike Top? Not Mike Top in general, but Mike Top in Sunday League. Well, do you know what, yeah? I don't know about that. I, mm. I doubt it. Mm. I, don't, I think I've seen someone do it before. I saw Mike Top before, like in the Prem, but I'm saying in yeah, terms of yeah. Sunday League, I'm definitely, they might be, they yeah. I'm not going to hold you on that. Mm. Um, but what I will say is I've seen them do innovative type of content. Yeah. Uh, the challenges, the, for example. The challenges was one, but then they also had one where it was like the players would be arguing about Premier League players or whatever, yeah. side by side, you have to join the sides. Yeah. That's innovative and that they, maybe it didn't go the way they wanted it to go in terms of the numbers, mm. but they always try new things. And even like on the build up to the London Cup, I like that whole angle about, you know, He's got the whiteboard there and he's saying, mm. um, Don Pires, yeah. pagan or whatever. <laughs> it's all of that. Yeah. That's like unique, isn't it? Yeah. Like You've got, you got to hand it to them. So I think a lot of other Sunday League creators could take a leaf out of their book in terms of just being a bit more creative and innovative. And try. Even the, um, I don't know if this is what you're referring to, but like the, the balcony challenges and stuff like oh, that. Oh yeah, the block battles. The block battles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You get yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. Even like the skits they did with my man. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. Bro, they're doing, they're yeah. doing bits though, so yeah. like, I, okay. respect, I respect their work ethic and their creativity still. Definitely star. Okay, right, so they're at the top, front runners. Let's go with a wild card. Let's go with Barnet Sunday League. Not yeah. a necessarily a team, but a league. Okay, you know? cool. So, again, three C's, starting mm. with content. Content. I feel like the content is, uh, <laughs> John's going to be on to me. You know? <laughs> I'm not dissing it, like, I think it's good. Yeah. I, I would say it's a B. Okay. Which ain't bad. Okay, why B? Um, I feel like um, it's not very innovative, like we've been talking about. Yeah. Uh, but the quality is good. Yeah. Like you can't deny the quality of the cameras they use. Yeah. You can't deny the commentary, even though it's not my cup of tea in terms of where I, I come from. Say, yeah. I can kind of, I can't knock it as well because there's an audience for that as well. Yeah. It's uh, very professional. It's very professional, which is like great. BBC, but it's not. It's not Sunday. It's league. not Sunday league. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's a bit too professional for yeah. me. But. I can understand why some people might like that. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Um, and the reason I'll say it is a B, it's just very generic. It's very like interview, yeah. game, like, no, lineup, game. Yeah. Half time, I don't even know if they go in the changing rooms. Yeah. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. Then second half, full time. Yeah. And I've had conversations with John, and you'll probably see a change in their content coming up in the year, in oh. next, se sorry, next season. Yeah. But I just feel like it's a bit too. Yeah, a bit too generic. And I think even a B might be a bit generous. Like, we'll um, stick with B for now. I agree with that. I yeah. think the, the commentary is not my cup of tea either. Mm. I need some grittiness in it. Do you know what you I mean? You do, bro. Like, um, something, something a bit different. Okay, I get it. They get like the, the goals, they get the game, yeah. all the rest of it. That's like the bog standard stuff nowadays. But yeah, like I said, yeah, there's nothing yeah. new in there that makes you think, oh, that's, that's something different. Yeah, it's, it's, it's quite plain and ordinary. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I feel like... I think that's a misconception a lot of people have maybe with Sunday League. It just looks like we're just recording games and putting it out. Yeah. When really there's a lot more thought going into these things and yeah. um, effort and like you say, commentary is a big thing. And mm. Don Straps is probably the favourite king of that, yeah. King, like king yeah, of yeah. it, yeah. Um, so people need to just take note of the GOATs and um, try to find their own way of reaching those levels because mm. another thing is the copycat culture i don't really rate either yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what i mean if someone is doing something original i kind of respect it a bit more even like the, my guys down at b2r mm. uh, i fuck with them heavy mm. um because their content is original do you mm. know what i'm saying even the commentary is original he's not trying to be like a joel Mensah. he's not trying to be like a don strapsy man's being owen do you get what yeah, i'm saying so yeah, yeah. like i fuck with that heavy stuff mm. Um, okay, let's go on to characters then. So again, with it being a league, it's not really any characters, it's just the commentator. Yeah, you so, can, I can't name one character. Yeah. Um, so for me, probably be a D. Yeah. A D. I'm sorry, but like... Yeah, it's like, got to be a D. Like we explained, like, commentary's fine, gets names correct and all the rest of it now, good pronunciations, but it's no... 
Oh, it might be an E, you know. I don't know, like, cause what, 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 what what's giving, what's holding the, the D? Oh, no oh, yo, relax. yo, hey, yo. <laughs> hey, relax. Yeah, no Diddy. No, yeah. put a pause whoa. in there, no. Whoa, whoa. Okay, you got, you let's got, move on. Let's keep. Like, oh, so you say E? I'm then? saying the E, especially definitely now. Oh, All right, e. e, okay. Damn. So then for consistency, I think that bumps up a little bit because they very are consistent. consistent. You know, they put Not it out consistent. on Wednesdays. Or we had this debate before, obviously. Um, with I'll it. give them an A for consistency. So yeah. Right. Hey, okay, okay. Yeah, because I feel like the reason I give it to them as well, not only are they being consistent, remember they're providing for the whole league as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. to be consistent for so many different teams, so many finals, mm. um, I feel like that poses a different problem than if you were doing it for your own team, because mm -hmm. we're all collectively going to be going to a certain location, X, Y, Z. Yeah. But if you're going to different areas of the, of the city, do you get what I'm saying? Mm. Um, you've got to respect that store. Right, we're back. We got kicked off the pitch, man. We did, man. Some younger boys or some bigger boys came and kicked us off our pitch, so now... It was like 12 we're in, years old. We're 12, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're trying to hype it up, yeah. Some, like, monsters came on the pitch. Um, but we're on the cage, literally next to it, so... Yeah, and it's still grassroots, man. Concrete jungle and all that sort of shit. I like it, man. This is, this is the essence. Exactly, this is where it all happens. So, um, right, let's go on to the next team now. Let's start with... Ah, let's go with Under the Radar. Under the radar. Under the radar. Mm. So, do I go first in all of these? Yeah, you go first. Oh, okay, it's your platform. <laughs> okay, cool, we'll do that. Uh, I'm being, being hospitable. What was the first one? Content. Content, yeah. Um, I'm trying to deep it, like I'm going over it in my head. <laughs> Remember, we're doing the one that sits on Manny's platform, not the one that, because they got two channels on notice. Obviously, Manny's got his own platform. He's the gaffer, he's the, the hon honcho. Well, but then they've got an under the radar channel. So what goes on there then? So that usually has like fives content, a little bit of like the mic'd up sessions and stuff like okay, that. Okay, I didn't um, need that store. But the actual games itself sit on Manny's channel. Because obviously that's probably like the bigger audience, isn't it? Yeah, no, I, I do like their content. Um, I'd give it a B plus. Okay, why a B plus? Because for me, I feel like um, this is probably how they want it to come across. Mm. But again, similar, similar to like the Barnet, mm. it's pretty much like the warm up, like, co co uh, I don't know the word, like in order of the day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. Which most of them do, yeah. but I don't find like there's much like interaction between like the players and, 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 and banter and stuff like yeah. that. Yeah. For me personally, like, and I, I fuck with them as well, like Marfs and that's my people's. Yeah. But um, yeah, if I'm being honest in terms of like, the overall content, I feel like it would be more fitted for me because mm. this is a personal opinion. They get loads of views. People like it, obviously. Mm. Um, it's still good, but it's just just below the A for me. Yeah, I think yeah. it's the same for me. I think like, yeah, good content. I like the fact they've got a high pod as well. Um, so again, you get that mm. kind of aerial view. So like RYG does that, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, RYG, shout out to them as well. Yeah. And then they usually have someone on the sideline as well. And I think what also makes it a little bit different is the fact that they have, um, I can't remember his name off the top of my head, but they have like a, they do like a fake Sky Sports segment where they cut to someone else when it when a goal goes in. Have you seen that bit? No, I haven't seen that, you know. Yeah, so they have like, oh, I'm in the studio and what a great goal by, I don't know. Oh, so maybe I'm Sam just Bailey, going, da, da, da. Oh, maybe I'm going by the old stuff I watch. Because I'll be honest, I don't yeah. watch everyone's thing like religiously yeah? every week. Okay. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. But no, that sounds that sounds innovative. Still. Yeah, I like that. I like it's similar that. Similar to like, I don't know if you saw when I used to do like the people's VAR thing, and I used yeah, to cut to like yeah, the referee. Yeah. yeah. That would reflect on some of like the the, some the, of the challenges. Decisions. In the yeah, game. yeah. So, so similar to that. Yeah, that's. But it. they only do that for the goals. That's it. So okay. again, they do have a little bit of difference. So yeah. The only thing is, no, I think yeah, I think B's fair. B's fair though, B's isn't fair. it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. B's Why fair. would you give it a B though? Because mine was that. Because I I felt like it was just done. Co co Chronologically, I don't know if that's all. Chronologically, a word. yeah. There we go. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> You're at school, innit? Yeah. <laughs> um, um, no, yeah, that's what I thought it was just like bang, like, okay, we turn up, everyone's meeting, yeah. changing room, warm up, line up. Similar to like how Barnet Lee kind of do it without the half time team talks. Yeah. But if they're cutting into like different bits, that's what I like that. I don't, it sounds good anyway. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. What would take them to an A, in your opinion? I think maybe, I don't know, maybe it should be an A. Are you going to give them an A? Yeah, if I, yeah I'm going to give them an A. Hey, Marcy, I've been swayed. <laughs> Manny, 
<laughs> so, no, no. I, I say I'll give him an A now that he told him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We we'll give him A's. All right, get an A's. All right, characters though. So characters, they've got obviously Manny. He's the commentator. Yeah. Marf, Gaffer. Yep. And then I think that's where it stopped for me. No, 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 no. Who else? John Wick. Oh yeah. Okay. All right. Come on, all right. bro. He's one of the biggest. But they're not. He's not on there enough. But when he's on there, it's, <laughs> it is it is Hollywood oh, stuff. Against SC Dons. Oh my god, that laugh. The laugh. Hilarious. Bro, the guy is one of the funniest, bro. Like, mm. even in even person, just he's entertaining just to <laughs> just watch, you get what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, no, that him, Marfs, and I actually like Manny's um commentary, man. Yeah. I feel like uh, uh He's got a few one-liners in there. Yeah, not not in terms of like uh He's more of a, a say what you see. Yeah, he's more of a say but what you he, see. He keeps it content. so neutral. I like it. He, yeah. he, he tells the truth about yeah. his team. He doesn't try to sugarcoat it for his team's benefit and that. Yeah. No, I, I fuck with Manny still. And like, again, it's a bit more edgier than like the BBC commentator that, that's on Barnet League. Yeah. You know what I mean? At least you can see Manny is from, do you get what I'm saying? He's from the ends and. Yeah. Do you get what I mean? As, as long he's not as. Like when we're talking about Don Strapsy, this is different. Like you can't find a Don, Don yeah. Strapsy, bro. That's, That's elite unique. levels. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he was a rapper before as well, so he so knows of how he's to. Got bars. He yeah. knows how to. Like he's, he, that's that's the levels. Like it's poetic the way he does it. And then um, Joel Mensah, he's got a character in himself. So I feel like Manny's just being himself, and I like that. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? I like so that. So what's the grade then? Um, for characters, yeah. it's an A, man. A. Okay. A John, as well. Are you giving it A as yeah, well? Yeah, yeah. Once he brought in John as well, then okay. That if it's just them two, I would have gone B. But yeah, a. yeah. I don't even know. I think his name. It's not because his name's not John, but he goes by John Wick on Insta. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm calling that. But it's yeah. Vance, is it Vance? Is it? Yeah, um, yeah. Bola. I think it's Bola Vance or something like that. Something like that. Yeah. I don't want to get it wrong, so yeah, just yeah. roll with John Wick. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but he's a character still. And then consistency. So. Yeah, that's, man. That's Got to give a, it a, yeah. yeah. They're, they're, week in, they're week working, out. man. It's we know where to out. find it. Yeah, so. they, they, they double up on games and, you know what I'm saying, they always get their stuff out. So, yeah, it's so, A. Hey. Okay. We're staying over in South London with The Wall. The Wall. Yeah, The Wall. Jeez, my peoples. So, I might don't be, be too biased, biased now. Yeah, yeah, I was going to say, don't be, be too biased. biased. Maybe I should start off with this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah there we All go. So, let's start off with content. Now, it's definitely A star for content. I love the... I love the obviously camera quality. I think they use black magic cameras. They do. Same um, as Beatty's, isn't it? Beatty's use black magic. There as you well. go. So yeah. again, if people are not too techy with that sort of stuff, that's pretty much creme de la creme. And they're using it for Sunday League. Mm. It's not like a phone, mobile phone. Or sometimes they might use a mobile phone, but again, yeah. it is the top tier. I mean, I will say that they have a production company as well. It does which, help. But it's not free. Yeah. So they still got to pay for it, but yeah. they do have the access to that type of equipment. Yeah. Uh, Drones, mm. uh, mics, different mm. angles. So, no, their production's A star. A star. Yeah. Characters, you've got um, obviously. Sean's elite. Sean. But can we, can we include Sean now? She, she officially She's left. left now, but like when I think of the wall content, it's yeah. like that's the first thing that comes in my head. Like, yeah. There's some epic speeches, yeah. epic predictions, epic team talks. Like, yeah, for me, like she's a character. Says. Sace is a character. Yeah. Uh, Who's the other guy? S is it SJ? The, the coach? Um, yeah, I yeah. believe so. Yeah. Is it Seb? I think, I think, I think it's so. Seb. Yeah. Character. Yeah. Even some of the players as well. Um, um, I remember. Cecil. 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 <laughs> Come on, man. He doesn't, <laughs> he doesn't even have to talk to be a character. He's on the pitch doing madness. Who's the guy? Oh, I think his name's a right back. Is it? He had Dasher on the back. Basically, I'll tell you the story. Oh, yeah, yeah. Emmanuel, I think his name is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Did, did you see it? No, I haven't seen okay, it. Okay, but... so basically, I filmed them versus AC Hamster Town down at AC Hamster Town's ground. And he was basically saying, Google me, Google me, search my name, and all the rest of it now. Yeah. When people say that, it's always going left. Yeah. Passes the ball back to the keeper, keeper miss, <laughs> miss kicks it, sorry, and the ball goes in. And obviously, he's the one who passed it back. Yeah. So after all of that sort of stuff, <laughs> Yeah, you left an egg on your face. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. But yeah, character in itself, that's just a, a golden clip. So, so, so what would you say for character? A. They got Percival as well, so that, yeah. Oh, A, Percy, A star. I said Percival. Percy, yeah, A, it's got to be. Yeah. The only thing that's going to let them down is the next one, which is consistency. Because mm. again, what we're hearing, they're folding. They're folding, yeah. So. so, And again, towards the end, again, it was a bit like here, there and everywhere. It was like, 
Yeah. Oh, we're going to post a couple of weeks, then we're going to go missing. Yeah, no, I hear you. And even um, I saw a couple of bits on like social media and that. Um, I think it was on some challenges and stuff like that. Mm. Um, but you could tell that it was maybe from a couple of weeks, if not months ago. Four, yeah. You know what I mean? Um, and there's nothing against that. But um, if we're going to grade on terms of consistency, then they probably have to get like a B from me. Mm. Mm. What would you give them on that? Yeah, probably more like a, or a B minus from just minus. being yeah. pedantic or whatever. So that kind of brings the grade down a little bit. Mm. So overall, let's say let's say a B plus overall. Overall, B plus. Yeah, them, B yeah. plus overall. Okay, cool. A lot. We're, we're being kind of generous, you know. When I think about this, because what Beatty's got A star. Yeah. Uh, Barnet League. What did they get overall? They got C overall. Oh, did we? Do, I think I we got. I think we got cut off. Basically, Barnet's getting a C. No, in fact, I it, gave them it. You gave them e. one of them, so maybe it's a C. I don't want to say D no more. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's say oh, it, let's say it's C. Yeah, C. C for Barnet. Mm. And then we just given the, the other one. Is it the wall that no, under, the, under radar, the radar? We've given them A stars. A star. And then we're saying the wall B plus. B. Yeah. Yeah. B that plus, makes sense, right? Yeah. That's 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 making sense, yeah. Okay. Okay. All right, let's move on to the next one before it starts pissing it down. Um right, have you watched these before? Five guys. Is is that your sort of I content? Have. I've, I've watched a couple of them. I think they're one of my favourites. Okay, cool. Right, yeah. so we can go with that one. Right, yeah, five guys. So, five guys. Starting off with characters, you want to start off? Um, I, I wouldn't be able to name the characters. Yeah. But they're all characters to me. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I think I know one of them. He plays for Olympia, I believe. Or he used oh, to play Barney. For Olympia. I think it's Barney. Nick Trace. Yeah, Barney. Barney. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, and obviously, I, again, I, I don't know their names. I don't watch it really religiously. But yeah. I, I like all their characters. Yeah. I feel like they've all got a bit about them on yeah, camera. Yeah, and they're, yeah. they're all friends, you can see, and they banter and they... And do you know what I like about them a lot? A lot of the times they turn up to teams that think they can bully them. Mm. And they still turn up and they stick up for themselves. And, and they like hold that. their ground, they I like that. Their, I like that. Yeah. I like that because they're, they're not the most intimidating bunch. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? You know you can get loud, boisterous teams yeah. that are, like, they're quite intimidating. They're themselves and they're I themselves. like that. Yeah, yeah, no, I like that, but they don't back down. Mm. And you already know what type of work goes into even making content. So mm. to deal with that on a weekly as well, mm. people trying to fight you or trying to bully you mm. and you hold your own and you turn up the next week and still be yourself. I respect that still. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I'm going for A-star. I'm biased. I don't care, but I like it. I like, I like Milo. I like Barney. I like Theo. I like, I like all of them. They, they all got their individual Milo's characters. Milo's the one that I like. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And, and I like it. Like they bring something different. Like, like we said before, Teams have got to bring something different to the table. They can't pretend to be something that they're not. Or yeah. try, try and be a team that's already out there. That, that's already been done. Essie Don's has already been done. Beatty's already been done. Be yourselves. And yeah, I like the fact yeah, that they're young, young lads, round about that kind of student, sort of mid-twenties era. So again, they're just having fun. And you can hear mm. it in the commentary as well. So No, no, I rate, I rate it. I, think, I, I haven't seen all the episodes, but I like also, you know, a lot of people try this thing where they kind of incorporate um, meme type edits within the middle of the co and it's harder than it looks to yeah it doesn't always work it, it doesn't, doesn't even work. land in terms of I timing think, I think they do it very well well that's what I was going to move on to in terms of content that's yeah. what that's because it's very meme heavy yeah um, the games um, sound effects not too much but again it's like they you can tell they're in the, the lab together just yeah, having yeah, a bit yeah, of fun yeah, yeah, yeah. probably got like some KFC or something like in the background just yeah, chilling yeah, out yeah. and I like they got a healthy balance between like you say like the the the, the banter between the lads and whatnot and the football yeah that's you, what it's about isn't you it? don't want to lean too heavy on either I don't think like, yeah I feel like you need that healthy balance and they, they've got that store yeah so it's an A for me as well A star for me as well and then consistency week in week out and I also got added into the mix as well they're now trying different things as well do you know what I mean they've okay. done the um, what's that slip and slide they've done that sort of video oh, really? before yeah okay, they've done okay, like okay. Um, kit releases as well because again their fan base is crazy yeah I feel like they're in a position where they can kind of do those type yeah. of things I feel like um, if you're starting up a Sunday league don't just start trying to do slip and slide challenges and stuff like nah. that I feel like if you're going to be a Sunday league team you've got to establish that first and then yeah then you move on to the other type of content because yeah. that content specifically needs some sort of following to capture it. Unless you're going to get a viral moment, which is you can't plan for that. Do you mm. get what I'm saying? So, mm. yeah, and no, I feel like their consistency is an A star from what I can see as well. 
So eight they, star all round, yeah. Getting eight stars all round. Eight star all round. Everyone's getting eight stars. Well, we'll see. Um, <laughs> <laughs> right, let's go on to bring me someone bad. Oh no! Hey, listen, don't say that, and then I'll say the next person, you and it'll be bad. Try, try to drag him in there. <laughs> <laughs> he did even a bit. Um, let's go on. To, oh, let's go on to Saha. I fuck with Saha. You already know I fuck with Saha. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So let's see um, about Saha. I, I'm gonna not. I'm not gonna lie. I haven't been like a. I've said this for everyone, but mm. genuinely, I haven't watched their channel for ages. Yeah. But the last one I watched yeah. was the cup final against Highgate, mm. and. That's a masterpiece, bro. Shout out to the man behind production. Hey, yeah, we know who it is. It's a masterpiece. Yeah, I, yeah, I love yeah. it. I love the way he's, um, you know, made it a bit more docky, a bit more informative, a mm. bit more about the club. I remember they lost that game 7-2. Yeah. And the game was out by Wednesday. Yeah. So the turnaround. Not hiding, turn, turn around quick. Mm -hmm. The um, length of it was lengthy, but still engaging. Mm -hmm. uh, you got to find out more about the club. I like the way... Like I said to you about the chronologically order, it's not done like that. Mm -hmm. It's like you can see the intro mm -hmm. and then it's dropping, it's chopping in between like before interviews yeah. to the game and then cutting back out to interviews. And yeah. that's my bag, isn't it? I like, Very innovative. I like the innovativeness about it. I like the uniqueness about it. I like the, is it the, the 360 camera they use? Yeah, um, on the sideline with the visible stick and that. There yeah. you go, that's something different. I like that. I like their characters as well. Yeah. I feel like they got big characters. I, I, see, I don't see too much of that. That's the only thing. And Mad, I, well, not in that episode. But, yeah. Um, Mad Jay's a character. Yeah, um, okay. You don't fuck with Mad Jay, no? No, listen. No, the way you said it, he was like, ah, okay. No, it's, I don't see enough of it. Okay, Do you know what okay, I mean? Okay. I don't see enough of it. It's um, usually like... But they lost 7-2. No, I'm not talking about the stat game in general. I'm just okay. talking about overall. Because I, I, I watch Saha content. I yeah. think it's got a hell of a lot better since, obviously, is it Ryan who's got involved now? I believe that's his name, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I believe that's his name. That's my oh. guy. <laughs> Shout out to Ryan. You don't like the attention, though, so I'm yeah, not trying to Yeah, like. yeah, yeah. But yeah, shot by Ryan. Uh, absolute guy. Yeah. Doing this thing. It's definitely got a lot better. But again, just, I feel like they're not too much of a character-driven team. Like, it's, it's commentator... It might go to Mad J on the sideline. It might cut to the gaffers on the sideline. It's not like... The I think others. if anything, because that's one thing that that episode doesn't have no commentary. Because mm. remember, he's using the interviews to kind of be yeah. the nar narrator almost yeah. of the episode, yeah, yeah, yeah. which is genius yeah. um, in itself, especially for this level of production, Sunday League. Yeah. Mm. Um, but for the past episodes I've watched, it would probably be they need that consistent commentator so that you're tuning in and it feels like familiar yeah do you know what i mean um but yeah i would say that's probably an area that they could work on but it looks like you know in um fifa where you got like the the arrows that go up and down they're, they're on green right now they're on the up <laughs> yeah they're sure. on the up still so I, I would give characters c for me characters um yeah no i, I would kind of go along with that i mean <clears throat> again i can't speak i'm i'm thinking more about when i've been there live so mm. I'm, I'm being, it's a bit of a blurred <laughs> lens I'm working through, isn't it? Yeah. Whereas you're kind of referring to the actual content you're seeing on screen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, maybe yeah. some of the things I'm seeing <clears throat> in person, like I said, I don't watch them week in, week out. It's yeah. not getting portrayed onto yeah. the camera. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> so I'll go along with what you say because I trust your judgment. Mm. But if I was to judge based off like being there live in the flesh, mm. like my J makes me cry like almost sometimes I think he's that funny still so maybe he needs to come on commentary there maybe he needs to be included more in it so yeah, yeah. No, maybe, maybe that's the one and what's the consistency consistency so they do upload every week um, it's an A for me just because you lost 7-2 in the final on a Sunday mm. and then you uploaded a masterpiece on the Wednesday mm. and I know consistency doesn't mean that one turnover yeah but as far as I'm aware, they're consistent in terms of every Sunday there's something uploaded. Yeah. Whether I'm tuning in and watching it full heartedly or not mm. is a different thing. But it seems like the uploading is is quite consistent from what I know, unless you No, it is, it, it is. is. The only thing, and again, this will probably go back to content, is that they haven't tried anything new. different, new. Apart from that one, there's a new one. Yeah, that one's a new one. Yeah. So again, they're still new in terms of trying something new, something innovative, yeah. something different. I like it within the episode, but again, they haven't done no challenges or podcasts or something mm. new that's different to like, yeah. oh, this is a new side of Saha that I haven't seen. Yeah, I think, I think you can kind of see that uh, they're in that transition from the content side of things, mm. just in terms of 
the transition they've been on this year mm. and that last episode was mm. obviously something new and like I said previously I feel like you kind of have to master that side before you start trying to incorporate in challenges and new content once you get that on lock yeah then you can maybe start trying to be a bit more creative and do new type of content potentially but I feel like there's there always been a club with massive potential it's mm. it's just a case of if they're going to be able to unlock that anytime soon all right so i'm giving them a b minus yeah it's your platform <laughs> no don't give me it, it's your platform listen i didn't bring you down for just to sit on the fence over there splinter oh gosh. you know what i mean um, master splinter over there Fifth yeah no i'll go along with a b a b sounds good to me okay um again there's a bit of uh but b for bias yeah all right cool safe that was a good one <laughs> <laughs> B for bias. No, B, B sounds fair. B yeah, sounds fair. No more, yeah. um, next one, Great Britain United. Do you watch much of their content? No, but I know someone. I don't watch any of their content. Okay. Uh, not <laughs> that sounding mad personal. Wow. <laughs> I know no, who you're talking about, Kiers, isn't it? That's my guy. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So like, yeah. I fuck with Kiers, and I know that he's bagging. But I would lie if I, I've, I haven't. I'm a busy guy, man. I'm sure you're busy as well. Yeah, but I'm, yeah, I'm a mad yeah. busy guy. So sometimes it's like finding half an hour to sit down or because it's, it's not even half an hour how many teams we've we laid out so i kind of catch a lot of things on social if something catches me on socials i'm like i need to watch this then okay. i'll tune in but i'm not like yeah like, roots is famous you know look at the school kids can we turn the cameras around nah it's not about them it's about us <laughs> look, they're, they're looking at your instagram no they're not bro they are the crowd around looking at this look, 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 looking over Oh, we're going to get beaten up call by school over. kids. Call them, should we call them over? No? Nah, okay. no. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> We've got time. Got um, in North, you know. <laughs> Easy. Right, anyway, back to where we were. We were talking about Great Britain United. So, mm. clearly, V doesn't watch much other content apart from his own. He's just biased. And so, Don't leave no budget. You're free TV. <laughs> all right, we've got Out enough plugs for that. All right, right all right, all right. Yeah. Um, we'll rush through this, though. So, Great Britain United, um, in terms of content, does the bog standard left to right, mm. filming, Sometimes two cameras. What's bog standard? Is that like a C? That sounds like a C, the bog yeah, standard. That's a C. It's okay. a C. Because again, it's just Is filming. it one angle, yeah? No, in fact, they do have two. Because okay. they, they, they hire in Neurons to replay to film the game. And okay. then they've got someone else to film the sideline. So, oh, fair play. So, yeah. Sounds right. But again, it's not nothing new. It's not. Yeah, no. It's not mic'd up. It's not a different camera angle like Saha. It's not, it's not nothing new. So, okay, that's yeah, the reason okay, why yeah. it's probably a C. Characters, okay. it's, the main character is the, the manager, Oli. Okay. Um, sometimes, you, obviously, in interviews and stuff before the game, you might interact with them, but I don't get enough to, like, okay, I want to yeah, yeah, follow yeah. that person's journey or whatever. Well, how, how long are their vi video, videos generally? Roughly about a 30 minute mark. Okay. How, how, in terms of just off, off subject, just yeah. curious, what, time of, what type of time do you think people, teams should be aiming for? Ooh, good question. So, you know again, I mean? for me, if I'm a long time watcher of you, I can watch 45 to an hour, like the Baytees video. Yeah. But if you're new to the scene, I think 20 is enough. I agree. And I also say as well, this is what I'll say as well, um, the intro, you've got to get to the game soon as. I think nothing mm. more than five minutes long, like, I know you want to do all the pre-match build up and all the rest of it, but after that, get, keep it to five minutes. I'm I agree. seeing some pre-match extend to 10 minutes and I'm like, I don't need to see that much of you. Yeah, I, I feel like the game needs to be starting after at least two or three minutes. Like, if that, if, if that. that. And, and what's a good trick, mm. I think you've done this before actually. Mm. Um, it's a good trick is showing clips, maybe the more highlighted clips that's going to be coming up. Oh yeah, coming up. At the beginning. Yeah, for sure. So it's a reason for people to, if they do Stick get bored, around. they can at least skip to the bits that they kind of want to watch. Exactly that, yeah. exactly that. So, so that's a good one still. Yeah, they, they've got a good, uh, in terms mm. of length, they, they, they stick to like 20, 25 minutes. Yeah, I think fine. 20 minutes is a good time. Like when I was doing non-league, no budget, like we started at like 20 minutes. So, and then we built it up as the demand went up. Yeah. But yeah, 20 minutes is a good way to kind of gauge Who's interested? Who's Make interested. sure you catch your watch time as well. You go into YouTube Analytics. Just, okay. just, just put it out there. YouTube Analytics tells you about your audience, where they falling Listen off. Him, bro. He's seasoned in this. Come on, man. Seasoned if you want people this. to stick around for the whole thing. No, I hear it. I hear it. It's, it's, yeah. it's important to analyze your material. And um, yeah, yeah, no, I agree, I agree with you still. Yeah. So characters, there's only one really. So again, it's D. I oh, know, pause, yeah, okay. Um. <laughs> One main character, really, and then the rest get some share of the spoils, but it's, a, it's a, 
letter after D, after C. After C. <laughs> you were to say you said after. That's a double pause. Yeah, and then consistency. It started off well, but they've fallen off. Ollie, I've been trying to WhatsApp you, call you, pick up your phone, man. I want to find out what's happened because they, they've fallen off, man. What, they've stopped uploading? Stop uploading. Oh, shit. I'm hearing through the grapevine. It ain't easy. I know. It, it started easy. off. A lot of people start and stop. Yeah. A lot of people it skyrocketed, start and stop. got to like 15k subscribers, which is pretty good for their first season, and then nothing. 15k. So what? What were they averaging in terms of like uh, views per video? Videos. I think it was like four or five k. But I think it's the shorts that got them up there. Oh, that's decent, bro. Yeah. For a new team. For a first season, yeah, that's good. And you're and you're saying that they they was doing like two angles halftime team talks. Yeah. So they must have had a decent following. Because where are they based? They're based out in um, Wickham. Because they were, they were going to play the Dons at Bolton Wanderers Stadium. That was the team. Oh, for real? Yeah. Because So get this, the, the manager, uh, well, the managers, should I say, or the owners, yeah. their parents or their mum owns Bolton Wanderers. Oh, shit. Yeah. So like, now the subscribers and views are starting to make a bit more sense. Oh, I don't know. Oh, come on, man. Like, network know. helps. Yeah, network, network helps. If you're able to drop a link in a group chat or spread it around people that can spread it around us, it's going to help. Isn't it? Mm, like, do you mm, know what I mean? Mm. And I feel like sometimes when it comes to plugging your own material, you have to be a bit, a bit shameless with it sometimes. But I feel like a lot of people don't do yeah. that. They'll upload and put no social clips up. Yeah. And or one little clip to say out now, <laughs> and they think that people should run to the channel. You gotta be. You gotta do more than that. You gotta be pumping that material out there, man. Yeah. So what are they getting overall then? Overall, they're getting a C. Um, but yeah, I just disappeared off the scene. Jeez. Really, after such a promising start, they disappeared. So. It's, and what they call Great Britain. Great Britain United. It's a good name, you know. It is. It is a good is. name. I like that name as well. It is. We need but you back, man. We need you back for sure. Next team is Hashtag United. We can just give them A's from now, innit? A's all. We have to, man. <laughs> like, come on, man. Like, what? This content? One, content, it's A star. A. Characters, PK a star. Humble. You've got PK Humble. You don't need no one else, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. And even the manager, I think, is a bit of a character still. Yeah, yeah. Um, Consistency. Devs, yeah. I don't even have to check. Spencer's been doing yeah. this. A star, A star, hashtag. All right, cool. Get him out of here. Man. Um, another one, top baller. So again, it's not a club. Top it's baller. The platform, top baller. Mixing it up now. Mm. What are we saying? So what's the first one? Content. Content. A star. It's a B from me. Whoa. Yeah. I haven't watched all of it, but I watched one the other day. And. And um, it's good. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. But I just feel like the production's not really what I expected for the hype. Really? Yeah. I, I don't know if you watch Streets Ball. Have you seen Streets? No. Streets Football. Oh, yeah, Streets Football. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have um, you seen their stuff? Yeah. That's levels. I think it's the same, isn't it? Nah, the editing's different, man. The edit, like, I don't, maybe I've watched the wrong episode. But, like, Oy. on Streets Football, I'm seeing them having power bars charging up and oh yeah, yeah, like yeah. The shout out to david weston by the way yeah 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 um, power bars drop like yeah they're so you're comparing it to streets okay okay because they do the same thing in it like yeah, yeah, 1v1s yeah, yeah so obviously streets football are doing the younger kids that yeah. are in academies doing 1v1s yeah in the ends brixton mm. and maybe it's a bit of the bias as okay, well okay there we um, go i fuck with um the people over there as well yeah uh, but I'm just very impressed with how they edit their stuff. Yeah. Like, I, like I watch it and it's like, I'm just engaged straight away from the Taking jump. In, yeah. Like, the people on the sideline making banter, I can relate to it a bit more. Yeah. Um, the top baller stuff, to me, it feels like, <laughs> they're probably just going to hate me now, aren't they? But like, it feels like to me that they bust and they're doing a lot of work. Yeah. And they've got a lot of sponsors on board now, like Adidas and blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Um, but if I'm being objective and I was watching it without the hype, yeah. I, I wouldn't have been giving it an A star. And obviously they get a lot of viral clips because they do a lot of content. They're booked in to go to this school, that uni, that yeah, yeah, yeah. place. So you're going to get viral clips, but yeah. it's, it's process of odds, isn't it? Like yeah. you're, it's going to happen. The amount of people that you see. Yeah, whereas yeah. like the streets football, <clears throat> they might have like maybe f five or six episodes or something like that. Mm. But if you go watch them, it's like the editing is a bit more engaging in my my opinion. So I'm giving a, I'm just I'm just going by, I'm I'm comparing them ultimately, isn't it? I'm mm. saying the streets football one and top baller. Top baller is well known. They mm. blew first. 
their idea, their concept, they can get top marks for that. Yeah. But in terms of the, the, the content when I watch it, I prefer the street football stuff. Okay, yeah. all right, okay. Yeah, yeah. Well, characters then. Um, characters, again, it's, it's kind of hard to do that because obviously they've got people presenting it, so yeah. they are quote unquote the characters. But then, because it's not a main team that they're around, it's hard to kind of... You have to go by the presenters then. Yeah. So if you're, if you're marking the presenter, what would you say? Uh, see again, now you're throwing in the streets and I know at least two of them, and in fact, yeah. the, the other one as well, uh, name slips my mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would say presenting wise, they're more engaging, more funny. Yeah, yeah, I agree. No, um, I, I agree with you. And again, it's nothing, it's no slight to top border, but again, it's just... It's the comp they're both, they're direct, not rivals, I'm saying, they're doing different, but it's the similar content, isn't it? Yeah. It's 1v1s. One, one yeah. Um, it's Tanoi, it's Alarms, it's everyone going mad with yeah, the yeah, yeah, and it's like the new craze now, isn't it? You yeah. see, the, the ones in Paris look wavy, mm. yeah, but everyone's doing this 1v1 thing. And, yeah. Um, so Top Baller are doing it and Streets Baller, they're the two people that I would probably identify most with that type of content. Mm. And I'm naturally just comparing them, right? Mm. Um, so similar to how I would naturally compare SE Don's video to a Beatty's video. Yeah. They're quite evenly matched in my opinion. Yeah. Um, but these two, I feel like streets, streets, they kind of take it a little bit still. Yeah. If I'm being honest, like, yeah. And it's, so, yeah, it's not, it's not even biased, like, but yeah, yeah. So characters, I would have to say C probably then, which leads us to consistency. They're consistent. They're consistent. Consistent, they so are. I can't knock that. So that would have to be an A. So again, overall, what's that? B. B? B plus. B plus sounds fair. Yeah. Top yeah. baller. I'm just trying to be honest, man. Top baller, don't, don't, don't think I'm hating. I'm not. Yeah, I'm you're not, not allowed hating. to take any of their clips now. I know, I, I haven't <laughs> taken any, to be fair. I saw one the other day where one you flicked it over the guy's head. Yeah, you weren't tempted, now. I just knew it was going to be, it's going to go viral, but it just, that, the, the, the cliff itself, <laughs> I thought, <laughs> Maybe I'm just a bit too critical, right? It, it, it didn't, it didn't move me still. Yeah. It didn't like, yeah, he flicked over the head and he struck it cleanly. It looked nice. But I'm just thinking about the, the, the players that I know. I don't know if you saw the, the, the one in Paris that went viral. Yeah. Right? Now that's something that you can <laughs> clip up and be, yeah. and be like levels. Yeah. Whereas the other one, it was more so the competition as opposed to him being anything extraordinary. But like, shout out to him, it's still a good clip. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's still a good clip, but like, yeah, I'm, I'm maybe a bit fussy, innit? Don't listen to me, man, Top Baller, you're doing your thing. <laughs> yeah. He knows his thing, listen uh, to him, yeah, listen to him. I'm, 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 um, yeah. Couple more before we get onto the, you know, the ones that you're probably looking for. Hatch Lane. Hatch Lane. So, so talk about Hatch Lane. Content. Content. Um, High pods, sidelines. Interviews before and after. It's, it's the bog standing in it. Yeah, I would give it a B plus. That's me. Um, I wouldn't have gone with that. I think I would give it a C. Oh really? Yeah, I think it's why? Because it's it's bog standing. What did you give um, Great Britain? I think I gave them C as well. Oh, you gave them a C. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So would you say them two similar content? Similar, yeah. Okay. Two two camera angles, one high, one low. Commentating, shout out Cash. Um, yeah, it, it covers it covers the bases, isn't it? No, I hear you. But it's just you. nothing in there that's different. No, you're right. I need to be consistent with what I'm saying again. Yeah. Um, I was gonna lean with a B. Mm. I said B plus, but a B is probably what my first reaction was in my head. Mm. Uh, but given the scores that we've given in different mm. different teams, yeah, maybe the C is a bit more uh, applicable. Um, but again, I, I wouldn't be the best person to ask in terms of expertise because, again, I'm out here working, trying to make the content that you're talking about <laughs> rather than watch it and be, uh, uh, and be watching every episode. But mm. the ones I have seen, um, like you say, I think that kind of fits the mold, doesn't it? It's a bit yeah. um, pre-match, 
warm up. Yeah. Two angles of the game, half time, two angles of the game. That's it. Commentator, full time, done. It's got to be, for me, and again, my art's at home, for me, it's got to be a USP in there. Even if it's a small USP. Yeah. Like yeah, I said, with yeah. Saha, the 360 camera, that's a USP. Yeah. That's something different. I haven't seen that yet. What would you like to see? What, what, because there's. I'm not giving ideas away. That's, that's consultancy fees. Okay, no, but okay, <laughs> I'm trying to think in my head, like, a different angle or a different spin on things. Like I said, even like under the radar where they flick to, like, they pretend to be Sky Sports in the studio. That's something different. Yeah, yeah. No, I something different, saying, like, yeah, different yeah. way of presenting it rather yeah, than yeah. commentator, the the Like even like um, your guys, M Boys, they did it in a vlog sort of, sort of format. Vibe, yeah, 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 you, yeah. Rather yeah, yeah. than I'm gonna sit down and commentate over this game. Yeah, yeah, So it's yeah, different, yeah. present it in a different so, way. Um, was it M Boys or was it, uh, do you remember Leverkusen back in the day, Bayern Leverkusen? Yeah. Never losing. Never well, losing, yeah. Yeah, never losing. Yeah. And they done one where um, it was interesting because their videos was the game in highlights, but then them recorded. In fact, Rising Ballers might have done this one first, but them recording, watching it, and yeah. then reacting and commentating That's to different. it at the same time. It's different, yeah. right? So yeah, I think yeah, you guys need to try to maybe think outside the box. That goes for everyone making content, like yeah. just try to think of innovative stuff. So I'll, I'll go along with that, let's so see. So characters then is a C for me. It's a C as well for me, yeah. Uh, consistency is an A, because they are, oh, hold on. Is it though? It's an it's a A, but it's a, it's a low A, because there's been a couple of weeks where they haven't had stuff. Yeah. So I'm saying A minus, so. Well, so do you, like on a Sunday, do you literally watch all of these? Yeah, Sunday is my, whenever your content is, mainly is the Sundays. I have a content wow, day, that's it. Wow, shout out to you, bro. Yeah. That's, that's this, dedication. That's, that's my thing, innit? How long do you reckon it takes you to watch all of these guys' material? Because a lot of people drop on Sundays, right? Yeah, yeah. Do you think that's a, that's a good thing? No. And I'll say this for free as well. Yeah, yeah. Again, sticking with the theme, being different, yeah. choose a different day. Yeah, 100%. I right. think it works. I think it works. I think it doesn't have to be, especially if you're the only, if you're filming a game and you're the only team to watch, if it's two YouTube teams, that's, we've had that conversation already. But again, say for example, if it's SC Dons, you can play, you can release your game whenever you want because you're basically playing a team that's not going to get views or not even filming yeah, a game. Yeah, 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 so yeah, you can yeah. put it out whenever you want. Yeah. I feel like, be different. No, be different. I, I hear you. I hear you. Because especially where it's like someone like me, for example, I'm maybe like the opposite to you. Mm. I'm, like I said, making content, making moves or whatever. Mm. And I don't really sit down and watch something unless it, it's just like on socials. And I feel to myself, I've got, I've got to watch this. Like the London Cup final, I'll watch both episodes because I'm mm. kind of something that I really want to watch. Mm. Um, but if you get someone like me on a Sunday, I may be watching one, two max. Mm. And if you're all releasing on a Sunday, that cuts out a lot of people. Yeah. And then we're on to the next week. Whereas yeah. if you drop on a Wednesday, let's just say hypothetically, mm. it's like you might, I might. Oh, no okay. competition. Yeah, no competition. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You promote it on the Tuesday, the Wednesday. I'm like, oh, I might tune in to watch this. Do you yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. You might get a, cu a couple more views and those couple could turn into hundreds, could turn into thousands. Yeah. Turns into comments and subscribers and followers. Do you know what I mean? So, mm. yeah, man. <sighs> Rising ballers. What were you saying? Uh, for the content, it's a B for me. Yeah. I feel like uh, since they've gone non-league, mm. similar to the question I was asking you about SE Dons, would they change anything? I mm. feel like they have changed it slightly. It's a bit more like streamlined, mm. chronological. Mm. Uh, like we've been saying, I feel like yeah. it's a bit like that. They're trying to be a bit too polished. Mm. A bit too clean, a bit too professional, mm. a bit too don't want to say something wrong here, don't want to say nothing wrong there. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's not my type of vibe. I, was, I would go a C. Um, Damn. Against, no, nah, but sticking with consistency, with what my answers have been previously before. Uh, and again, because I've been a, a Rising Baller supporter from a while, yeah. I've seen what they can do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty much movies in terms of like mm. following players' journeys and the rest of it to what it is now. Mm. I think. When Maz left, a whole lot of stuff left. Not just the manager, he was the commentator, a whole lot of charisma. And again, the comments say, oh, if you yeah. check out the comments in the previous videos, they're not feeling the new commentators. Oh, they're not feeling real. the new content. And so, what, it's and a did shame. You, did you speak to Maz about this? What? Yeah, um, some stuff I won't leave for here, but again, it's just like, 
But did he say, like, does he still tune into it? Is he still Yeah, involved? he still watches it. Again, he's still yeah. a supporter. He likes the content. Yeah, he still watches it. But, you know, okay. <laughs> it's... No, for, fair enough, For man. me, it's a, it's a C. Like, for what it could be, like, I still feel like they should have... It's like removing um, Strapsy from SC Dons. The fact that they took Maz away. And again, yeah. it was that consistent voice. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, I hear He was you. such a main figure. And again, to remove him, it's, it's hard. So when um, they did make that transition to non-league, Mazza was still the gaffer for a Mazza season. Mazza still the gaffer. But so then was they, he still doing the commentary then? For a little bit, and then they removed him, and I think they solely let him focus on the management. Okay. And then they got, a new, they got two new kids in, which I don't think they were proper in the football scene. And then they left. Then they got someone else in. They left. Even the cameraman, shout out Sean, the cameraman, he filled in for a little bit as well. So it's missing that consistency with the voice as well. Mm, That's hey. very key as well. Yeah. So all of that is is to see for me. And again, like there's nothing innovative now in there. Like before, they would, like I said, shoot documentaries on their players. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. You'd 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 buy into the players themselves. Like you'd know their journey. Now they don't do that. Yeah, it's just like very you. bog standard is the game. And then I hear you. I feel like they've turned into maybe a bit more of a, a business in the sense of like. Well, they are a business. So well, yeah, they're business. And like obviously they they got the elite stuff. They're doing the interviews now with like mm. the. I think the, the one that, that came out, um, now a ranger, done yeah. one with them. Yeah. Uh, they done, what's my man that was in Love Island again? Tyreek. Uh, Tyreek, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So they're maybe concentrating a bit more on those number side driven yeah. type of content that they know to get numbers, um, which we can't fault from a business point of view, but f as consumers, mm. we're thinking, ah, oh, we did like to hear like the Ruben Carvalho stories. Yeah. We want to hear about this guy that's, um, what's the guy that went, uh, Illy man, Illy man, signed for Sheffield United and all the rest of it, all of those stories. And they, that's, what they, and that. that's what they did so well, that was their USP. That's why they would have got an A star star. Yeah, yeah, But yeah. since then, it's not been the same yeah, energy know, put I, into it. So, I hear it. So yeah. characters, what would you say? There's characters, no characters there. there's no, again, they don't, they don't do the character work no more. So again, knowing for what they can do compared to what they're doing now, it's, it's a C. It's a C store, okay. And then consistency, they're consistent. No. They're not. They've even stopped now. I think I think the comment section's got to them. The fact that, you know, people weren't feeling the commentators. Shit. So they've stopped. So I can't even give them the consistency. I've got a rate Roots, you know. Roots be watching everything. No, but I'm, no, a, I'm, I'm a, like a fan. You know, you're, you're an advocate of what you represent. I'm a Grass fan. Roots, like, so when people it. say, uh, I don't just do this for views, or whatever. Like I'm a fan of this. Yeah, no, I get so, it. So when it. people want to quiz me on stuff, like by all means, let's have a conversation. So let me speak to you about, uh, from a fan's perspective, just a segue mm. uh, off that quickly. Um, Rising ball of sea, by the way. Do you, overall. do you feel like the era of grassroots content now has gone down? Yes. Do you feel disappointed as like a, a grassroots fan to see where it's? Because there was a point where I was envisioning it just. Sky rising, yeah. I and think I was fully invested. I knew the Takers players. Yeah. I knew the Rising Ballers players. Mm -hmm. I knew the Lambert Four Stars players. I knew SC Dons. I knew all these people. Mm. But somewhere along the line, my interest has just kind of dwindled. Yeah. Like I still care about it and mm. I try to create it. And the stories I know from my communities and my people and stuff like that. Mm. But there's just a lack of genuine, authentic interest from me. Like. I'm I think because excited. you know what's not, not sparked your interest? I think it's the lack of, um, it's saturated. So everyone's jumped on the bandwagon, got one of them on the sideline doing that. But that's a good that. thing though. That's great, good. But it's all the same. Yes. The problem. They, the innovativeness, or inno yeah, that and the, the creativity. It's innovative. No, go on, you do it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and the creativity is just, it's lost. It's like, oh, what do we do with it now? We, we're filming our games, great. Yeah, we'll yeah, we'll yeah. share our clips with your fresh or roots or whoever wants to post on our page but you got you got to be creative in this no, do you know what I mean no, like you've got to think like... of something different like we're two guys loving Sunday league and non-league all the rest of it sat in a cage we haven't seen this done before since Poet and Vooch yeah no facts do you know what I mean no, and facts. they weren't talking about Sunday league that's new mm -hmm. I love Sunday league don't get me wrong but it's just like in terms of I, I follow the scene more mm. than I do the content now yeah so like I follow Who's winning? Who's mm. losing? Who's winning this cup? Who's mm. that? I, I love the scene. Yeah. But in terms of the content, it's like, to me, you've got, I don't mean no disrespect to anyone out there, by the way, that's making mm. content. But to me, it's like, you've got the SE Dons, mm. you've got the Bay Tees, mm. 
And after that, I start to struggle about teams that I'm genuinely excited for their content yeah. to come out. And you've got five guys, but they're not necessarily part of the, the Sunday, Sunday League scene. scene. Yeah, yeah. Rising Ballers is non-league now, and it's from what you're telling me, full left. But well, from when they went non-league, I kind of just like, and they polished up. Yeah. It's like, it weren't for me anymore. Yeah. Um, but other than that, like, I know there's people out here doing their thing and they're making good quality edits, but it's still not innovative. Yeah. It's not unique. That makes yeah. me say, I need to tune into you. Mm. And you don't, when it comes to content, you don't necessarily have to be winning all the cups and stuff no, like that. Not at all. I mean, it helps for engagement, yeah. but if you make your content unique enough um, and more so friend driven, getting to know the characters. Um, my, some of my best content was there in goals, where it's just literally just me on the sideline filming because authentic not, yeah, yeah yeah authentic man. just seeing people getting nutmegged and all the rest of it because yeah. yeah, it didn't have to be polished it was just me shouting out flipping you need characters man like, yeah. i turn up to i turn up to games sometimes with my camera and it's like i can see from the players body language already they don't even want to be on camera yeah they're worried they're too worried now about going viral for yeah. the wrong reasons well there's there's two types of people when you got the camera there's people that flock to the camera and there's yeah. people that run away from like no nah, no nah, don't want to be on camera yeah, yeah, yeah. i've got a case or a case yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah no face no case yeah one of them so mm. Yeah, you, as, a, as, a, as a content creator yourself, you, you can tell that out yeah, easily, 100%. right? Yeah, 100%. But I feel like back in the day, when I first started, mm. it was the opposite. Mm. There was more people that wanted to be on camera yeah. than there was that didn't. Yeah. And I'm trying to, I feel like maybe the, the integration or the, the, uh, the progression of like content and them seeing those ones go viral of like, are oh, you right? You could end up a meme mm. on... Twitter tonight. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> tonight. Has made them realise, yo, not for me. Like, I don't want to be in it no more. But I remember, like, travelling to North, trying to, like, find out more about takers who were levels in terms of content creation, players, everything, characters. Mm. They had it. Rising Ballers up in North. And then, obviously, we had Lambert Four Stars, Beatties, SC Dons. I, I thought we'll be creating more teams of that ilk. Mm. But Rising Ballers going non-league and then takers folding. Mm. and land before all stars fold in mm. you've taken up three big big dogs big teams yeah you get it? so it's 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 not looking good man it's not looking good like there's like in terms of content creating for the teams yeah has anyone replaced the takers in terms of level of playing and content definitely not this side of the water for sure or anywhere just as a number uh nah not there, to that level there isn't no one nah and 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 there's people that have got good content, like Sporting Continental. I don't know if you know about them. Yeah, yeah. But um, they're good. Carpet have got good content. Yeah. But um, back in the day, we had guys that were all competing for the same trophy mm. at that level, being consistent, putting out their content. It was a, it was a great time. Do you mm. know what I'm saying? And then we had me and you filling in the gaps for other teams yeah, that were maybe yeah. not got content, but yeah. we're making them visible online. Yeah. But now. I know you watch it every Sunday and I, I admire it. Do you get excited for it? Certain games I do. If I, if I know there's a, it's a big game or there's something on the line, I think it's the more the story. You know, if there's, yeah. if there's a prior... Uh, even though you know the result already? Yeah, even though I know the result. If I'm not here, especially if I'm not living in London no more, like yeah. if there's a, something behind it, then OK, cool. Yeah, I want to see yeah. what happened. No, 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 I hear so it. So it's got to be, like, you've you got to kind of sell it to me. It's almost like WWE. Sell me the, sell me the dream, sell me the storyline. All right, let me ask you a question. Yeah. Outside of Beatty's and SC Dons, mm. what is the last episode yeah. from a Sunday League team that made you say, that was Levels? Oh, it would be Saha. Yeah, Saha, okay, we take that away because yeah. we spoke about it already. It Saha. Apart from that, ooh. Because I would like to go watch it. I genuinely would like to watch it. I, I don't know, man. I don't know. Sometimes now I just watch games just to see if there's anything in it to clip up. Clip up, yeah. yeah and, rather and yeah, than just so to watch it as a fan. So, so you've got like invested interest. Like, yeah. You want to take a little clip and use that. But like, I used to get excited for mm. release days, bro. Like I remember like, yeah. getting excited. But now, like I said, I'm, I'm asking you to tell me one, bro, because I, I, I like good content on Sunday. Yeah. Days. I'd say the ones you mentioned there, Carpet, it's definitely worth watching. Who have I got on the list as well? Um, Rest World, I watch as well. Oh, Dimitri, um, yeah, yeah. Dimitri, shout out Dimitri, because that, again, that's something different like from the Rest that. point of view. I like it. He's consistent as well. Um, so again, oh, okay, quick fire ones. Okay, got yeah. it. So Rest World, what would you give Rest World overall? I'd give him an A. 
Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I feel like he's a bit of a character himself yeah. as well. He's, he's like not, he'll say, he speak his mind. Yeah. Uh, he's consistent. Yeah. Um, I like it, yeah, and I yeah. think the content's good. Only thing I would say, Dimitri, is cut down that intro time. Sometimes the intro time's a bit too long. Just, I want to get to the game. No, but I want to get to the game. Listen to him, man, listen, listen to him. I want to stuff. get to the game, but I would give it an A, because it's, again, it's innovative, yeah. it's new, you're a bit of a character yourself as well, you explain the decisions, you interact with your audience as well, I noticed in the comment section as well, so that's mm. all good. Dope. So I'd say that's an A. Um, let's go with Kitchener. They've been around for a, a hot minute. Kitchener. Based on Ipswich. Again, this is... I might be the wrong person to do this, but I haven't watched one a Kitchen episode for a while. Yeah. But from what I can remember, I'd give them an A. Mm. Um, I feel like what I can remember for them, they've done little innovative things when someone score, um, shoots over the bar. Yeah. The yeah, ball yeah, goes yeah. wild. It's yes. like all around the world. Like, I like that type <laughs> of stuff. You still do it's that. Different. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, good. Yeah. That's good. Um, the commentary is very in sync. Like I've never seen like a back to back commentary yeah. setting, which yeah. is cool. Yeah. And they do rap as well. So the way they're delivering their words is on point. Yeah. Feel like they got characters and plus they represent a whole area and demographic that's not covered mm -hmm. um so for me um unless they're not being consistent mm -hmm. that i don't know about i like it yeah i think it's good It'd probably be the last one in terms of consistency they've had a couple of times where they've missed weeks okay. um due to like and they're trying different things as well which i like because sometimes they, they put it to the audience like because uh. they were battering teams like seven eight nil and it was like is this good for you guys to yeah, watch yeah 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 so yeah, yeah. i like that so that the fact they're actually thinking about that sort of thing, yeah, it would be an A. Uh, although the last video they put out, I think they must have had like some dodgy cameraman because he was missing goals left, right, and centre. Oh, but they did explain that. In there's the nothing more annoying than a shaky camera when you're, <laughs> when you're trying to watch a game. Like, and it's blurry as hell as well. I don't know what they were filming yeah. on. Like, was it a Nokia 3310 or I don't yeah. know? Like, yeah, but overall it was an A. It was an A. Mm. Um, we're still staying with the quick fire ones, so we'll go with. Let's go with. Sunday League settings, do you watch that? I like Sunday League settings still. Yeah. Um, Again, representing the area of Birmingham, pretty much the whole of the league. Yeah, um, I, would, I would give it a B. Yeah. Um, just because, similar to what we've been speaking about, yeah. I feel like it's very chronological mm -hmm. arrival time. Mm -hmm. I think the uniqueness about it is that he's representing a whole league, a whole demographic. That and no he seems touching. to know, shout out to Faz as well, like you know everyone. Like he can call out every single name many times in a game and yeah. he does all the league. What's, what's his little catchphrase? Um, well, the Lino one or is it... Um, now you see it, now you don't. Got, yeah, now you see it, now you, now you don't. And also Lion's got his ruler out, straight as an arrow. Oh, okay. Straight as an arrow, that's I like a shit that, no, I, like, I like his commentary. Yeah. I like the fact that he's very impartial to teams as well. He's yeah. very neutral, but he knows all of them very well. Yeah. Um, but in terms of content, I, I would give it a, a B plus. Yeah. What would you give it? I would say B plus as well. Yeah, I yeah. think sometimes, the only other thing I would suggest is like, it's a bit too long in terms of like some some episodes I've seen are like 40 minutes long. Oh, really? Or 50 odd minutes long. And I'm like, I don't know if I'm engaged for that long. It's okay, only certain yeah, times yeah, I'm engaged yeah. for that long. I'm with you, I'm with so you. So that's the only thing. But um, yeah, right, let's get them out of the way. Last one, Essie Dons. Yeah, it's no point even. You know what that is, man. Like, come on, it's an A star. A come stars, on, isn't it? Like Consistency, fives, elevens. Um, They've done content outside the box, whether they don't do it now or not, but they've done podcasts, they've mm. done the sit down in the, in the in the bar one where you kind of have a debate about yeah. a subject. Yeah. They've done the sitting down with players, getting to know their journey and, yeah. and whatnot, and all on top of being consistent. Mm. And characters for days. Characters come on. for days. Like, commentary is unreal. Yeah. Uh, you can't complain. Yeah. Do you get what I'm saying? Subtitles, all the rest is there. Intros, catchy, you'll probably listen to the music on the card rolling, do you yeah. know what I'm saying? So, no, yeah, so it's Even some of the lines, some things don't need commentary. commentary. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, it's dope, it's So, dope. yeah, it's an easy one. So, yeah, A star for SC Dons. SC Dons, so the leaderboard is pretty much what we would have predicted. It's like SC Dons, Beatties, Five the Guys, Under the Radar. Under the guys, radar. Yeah. 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 Really Let us know in the comment section below. Would you have changed anything? Any new teams to look out for? Um, so yeah, that's it really. Say no more. It's been a pleasure. And a pleasure. As always, my bro. We're freezing cold, so we're gonna go inside now. Make but, sure yeah. you like and subscribe. There you go. Yeah. Roots TV. Boom. Doing You're fresh for the people. There we go. Say nothing. Peace.